Mr. Speaker, six months ago, my constituent, Alison Ozer, experienced one of the worst nightmares a parent can ever face. Her children, her four children, were taken by her ex-husband. Alison has reason to believe her children are now in Kurdistan, in northern Iraq. Today, she is here in Ottawa, urging the government to do everything it can to help bring her children safely home. Can the minister please inform the House and Alison what actions the government is taking to ensure the safe and immediate return of her children? Mr. Speaker, I want to thank the honourable member for his question and for his tireless work on this important file. Our government remains committed uh, and, and concer deeply concerned about the safety and the well-being of the Azar children. Uh, we have been in constant and regular contact with Ms. Azar. In fact, I met with her yesterday and I spoke to her again today before question period. I want to assure the House that our officials are working closely with government authorities here and abroad, and including law enforcement uh, agencies. And I want to take a moment to recognize Ms. Azar's strength and commitment. I want to assure her and this House that we are very committed to the return of her children safely at home. Yeah.